Welcome back to the Insanity. My name is Cypher, and today we're going to be doing some Besiege. This game I live streamed a couple of days ago, and I really enjoyed it. It's completely like basically it's just building and that's what I like about this game it's building and to progress through stuff so you have to build different stuff to progress to different levels so in some you have to build something that will destroy something or something that will um, move around something or something that will jump over something it's all those sorts of things so I'm going to be doing today some sandbox so I can build whatever I want. Whatever I want is... Who knows? So, sandbox. Basically, free build mode disables borders. So basically, I can build as big as I want, as much as I want. So I was thinking... Uh, obviously, in my live stream, I created many different things I created I think oh, I can't remember what we called it now uh, what did we actually call it it was some it was like in oh that was it the, uh, the depending doom it's just like will it bring doom depends because <laughs> it was just an, a monstrosity of just rockets cannons spinning blades and everything and it was brilliant and I also tried to build like a catapult slash slingshot and it, I couldn't quite figure it out because it was the first time, time I ever played the game uh, so I thought if I went into sandbox I could learn a few things uh, I'm not under any time scale I don't have to progress or anything it's literally just build what you want and see if it works so we're gonna build whatever I want and hopefully hopefully it works so basically you get your s normal blocks which are your smalls uh, small blocks your um, large blocks your log block your wooden poles your braces and stuff like that your joint your swivel joints and everything like that you come to locomotion which is your wheels your steering hinges and stuff like that Ooh, powered co unpowered cog powered cog what can I put through cogs Mm. Who knows? Grip pad. I don't know. Uh, and then you come to your mechanical, which is your decoupler, your contractible springs, your suspension, your sliders, your pistons, and then you got your weapons. So basically, you've got an on just an onslaught of weapons, which is fantastic. The bombs, flamethrowers, rocket launchers, grenades, cannons, drills. You come to flight, you've got your flying blocks, you've got your propellers and stuff like your wings and s there's loads of different things, balloons, uh, you come to your armor, you've got your armor and your your ball holders, your spike balls and stuff like that, metal plates and everything. Then you've got search so you can search for what you need. So basically you can build whatever you want. This game has literally no limit to what you can build. If you've got it in your head you can pretty much build it from this single block here so let's get right into it shall we I think I might build some form of tank what do we say a tank I'm thinking yeah I'm gonna think about a tank so what's a tank got it's got a very large base so we're gonna start with a very large base don't know how large it's going to be this base. We're probably going to go out one more, maybe. And then one, two, three. It's going to be very, very large. Right, so what we've got so far is uh, just your standard ordinary base. With wheels on it. It's going to be a big one. It's going to be very, 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 very big. Um, hopefully we're going to fit a big turret to this that will fire a rocket. Maybe. Uh, I'm also thinking of like having a dispenser so more rockets will like fall into the chamber. 
I'm thinking of that because we can't just have like it firing one rocket at a time, can we now? We ha it has to fire multiples. Am I am I right? Am I right? Yeah. <laughs> so I'm trying to think of ideas. This is going to it's not going to look like a real tank. I mean, come on. I'm not that good. Um so it's kind of be kind of going to be uh, hit and miss with a few bits to see how it looks and whatever well, well we can see we can see, we there's progress there's progress within this you're just going to have to like you know bear with me so as you can see it's uh, it's building structure i think i'm going to have a add to add a lot more strength within the these bits underneath I'm thinking so anyway because <laughs> it's gonna be very 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 like it needs more strength let's put it that let's put it in like simpler terms it's gonna need a hell of a lot more strength so we're gonna add some uh, more beams across I think like so and then I think when we obviously build a bit higher we're gonna add some braces as well to sort of like hold it from like sagging in the middle so it doesn't like bend or bow out of place kinda looks like a weird castle on wheels doesn't it but yeah it's uh it's a work in progress I think it'll work eventually right okay in a weird weird sort of way I don't think this is going to hold. <laughs> I may be wrong, but I don't think it's going to do it. We're going to add braces in, obviously, but so far, this looks rather ridiculous. <laughs> um, but obviously, obviously, we are going to add stuff in to make it stronger. Ah, oh, damn it. That has been a, a recurring thing, me putting a block in the wrong place and then having to delete it. Or me placing a block where I thought it was, looking, and then going, hang on a minute, where's my block gone? And then having to go and find it. Which has been another recurring thing. Been attempting to find blocks that you uh, placed and can't even find. So it's... Uh, it's a work in progress. It's a very much a work in progress. Yeah, well, should we put it on the floor and actually see if it goes anywhere? Because this is a lot of weight. A lot of weight. So, fit to the floor. <laughs> ready? Are we ready for this? Because this may not work. Oh! Well, it moves. It definitely moves. Hang on, I'm just uh, doing settings. It definitely moves. Uh, problem is, it needs bracing. Lots and lots of bracing, because that just fell right off. Right, so what I've done is I've braced it to the absolute max. I've braced it underneath, I've braced all the wheels, I've braced the back, I've braced the front. I have braced literally everything. I've tested it, and it works, and it moves without falling to bits. So, now to figure out the top. Figuring out the top. I don't know how I'm going to do this, if I'm perfectly honest with you. So what I was thinking, obviously... Um, it technically just like needs... One to hold it in. Uh, what, like one block 
wide to actually hold in it, it the rocket or whatever I'm putting in into position it just needs that one block which will be this part um, so if I can keep it tied into one block it's going to be so much better because it's going to keep it in a straight line he says praying <laughs> right um, so yeah I think we are about ready it does look like a rail gun doesn't look like a tank at all it's like a rail gun this is now hopefully that should keep it in line yeah. and then we want a dispenser uh huh. A dispenser. How I'm going to do the dispenser is beyond me. I don't know whether to just um. I honestly don't know. I really don't know. Because if one drops in the wrong way, uh, the wrong way round. How big is a rocket? Let's just look at that. They're not that big. So if I put one block there, what have you done? Why have you done that? You don't go there. That's bad. Bad of you. like that, that should hold all that into place he says just play Ooh, wobbly wobbly three frames per second we're at currently for the giant oh my god my frames per second is just like disintegrated to nothing okay one rail gun slash tank with a piston to keep everything out he says frames per second go back up to you what you want to be thank you very much it's a shame I can't toggle that to just like be constantly out What's toggle mode? Oh! So click it and click it again. That's better. Yeah, right, okay. Brilliant. Even better. Even better. Right. I think the only thing left to do, really is fill it up with rockets this could go horribly wrong okay that seems to have worked so Z away <laughs> that kind of worked uh, I don't know what's gonna go in next what what sort of fell towards the piston Kind of looks the top one off of there, which would have been M. So, unlock the piston. They seem to be stuck. We may have an issue. Oh! I pressed one by mistake! Yeesh. So what ha oh dear. I hate to say six rockets went off. It seems to have held itself pretty damn well. Wow. Well that's uh didn't go quite to plan. It fires a rocket. It fires a rocket. Uh we uh so you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna put that inside. 
dumpy. Uh, I'm gonna just gonna dump a load of rockets in there, I think, and then give it a good farewell. So click uh, Z. You can go on your merry way. Whoa. Oh. Oh, deary me. There you go. I like how the bracings hold it. Look at it. It's all holding its shape. But yeah, that is just like a burning rubble now. That's a shame. Well. That was a tank. <laughs> that was a uh, uh, that was a tank. Apparently, that is my first ever time building an actual tank that actually moves and actually fires a rocket in out of it out of a barrel. So for a very first attempt, I don't think that went too bad. And I love how the bracing is still holding its shape. It's still somewhat holding its shape. But yeah. That was my very first ever tank. Obviously, this is the second time I have ever played it. So my skills will improve over time. Eventually, I'll be able to build some sort of flying dragon that breathes cannonballs. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, anyway. I'm going to end the video there because I think that took a long time to actually build. And it... Worked and didn't work at the exact same time. Also, it killed my frame rate. Like, legitimately killed my uh, frame rate. So, yeah. I'm going to end the video there. That has been a one day build of a tank that fires a rocket and moves. Kind of looks like a rail gun, though. Hello, Mr. Rocket. What should I build next? That is completely your decision. I'm leaving this completely up to you. So leave a comment down below what you would like to see me build next or attempt to build. It can be anything. Quite literally anything. Just leave a comment down below of what you would like me to build and I will build it. Also, don't forget to leave me a like. And if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ding dong that little bell to get every single notification. All my links will be down in the description for Twitter and Discord if you would like to join me on them to keep up to date with everything that's going on with the channel and future events that are coming to the channel. So, yeah. I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. <laughs>